Hey guys, Gaming Dynamite here. Um, playing some um, Stranded. Uh, massive mod. Let me just turn the sound on. Um, it's it's a survival game. Just collect resources, survive for as long as you can. Um, there's really no objective, unless obviously you're playing the um, storyline, which is obviously objective based but apart from that if you go around the island you can play endless um, it's also free it's a it's made by open open source software um, the link will be in the description so if you want to download it it will be there um, so I'm just gonna just for now it's just gonna be gameplay but if you guys like it then I might start doing a let's play um, but let's see how it goes so I've set the map size to big the terrain to normal and the game mode I think should be normal so let's get started you're stranded Try to survive. Besides this, there is no special aid. Look around the shore for supplies from your wreck. Have fun. Difficulty normal. An average amount of resources and dangerous animals. You have some supplies at the start. Plants require watering every two to four days. Medium cook times. Fountains and wells are disabled. Food poisoning is enabled and medium for damage. So let's get over to the island and see where we take where we can take off. Blah. Right. So we're gonna need some branches and some pebbles, so bash the tree down like so. And that's enough. Um, but you can just take stones and from wherever seems to be like a stony surface. Um, and then you can craft the, the stick and the uh, pebble or stone. Click on here and then you can make yourself a hammer. So it's gonna. Oh. Birds. Created two hammers. I was pointless. Well, guess we may need it, but don't think we will. Just equip this. And um, if you guys also want, I'll go. I'll make an in-depth tutorial for the game. Just if you guys want to play it and want to learn how to play it. And also, I'm using um, the massive mod. If I haven't said so already, but the massive mod adds a lot of content which the game doesn't have and um, like new resources and um, I think more mobs I'm not quite sure but something like that so we're just going to take the wall from this to Mr. Rogers um, so basic idea is just make shelters, see how long you survive on the island um, feed yourself basically the four bars on the top left hand corner represent your health um, I think obviously the the top is the orangey yellowy green bar represents your health um, green represents your hunger so um, I'm quite hungry now, well, not quite, but hungry. And the blue represents your thirst. And the purple represents yeah, your fatigue. So, qu quenching your hunger. Well, yeah, yeah, the green one is for hunger. And we need to, yeah, just drink some more. So, you need to keep an eye on. Your, um, your like your status of like your body at all times to like in order to survive basically so without 
can think yourself with food or water if you don't think about that with the game you won't last very long so let's just go get some branches and produce a hood where we can see it's quite tedious just waiting and clicking on the um, uh, to get the resources but you know it's, it's actually a really fun game uh, I would recommend you give it a go as it is free so um, there's nothing to lose I suppose so washing some trees um, yeah eventually if you do keep like basically bash the hell out of the tree it will eventually fall and produce logs which you can use um, you can use logs well, to produce um, advanced huts and you can use it to make rafts I think something like that um, as you can see I'm getting a thirsty th oh, well, thirsty but I have no vasa um, and drinking salt um, drinking the uh, sea water will not help it will just make you more thirsty so I think we are going to die. I know we're going to die. Unless I think I see some crates. Yeah, you'll find some crates spotted and dotted around the sides of the island, which you are supposed to be supposed to have dropped. In you got shipwrecked on the island because that's just the basic idea of the game. But I don't know how we are going to survive. Oh, bollocks. I was hoping for that to be water. But now we're going to die a slow and painful death. And you're going to have to just bear with me here. Because I do not think there are any water supplies around here. <sighs> this is... There's a real quick gameplay, but let's see how long we can survive for. If it was food, it would be no problem. Oh, too bad it's not food. Then we'll just get the food down and try to look for water. And um, you'll find water springs around the island you um, land on, but there doesn't seem to be any water springs here, which is unfortunate because we are dying. I think we should put this on an um, easy game mode for now because I'm no pro at this game. So, yes, I am dead. Start again. And the normal, yeah, easy. Okay, right. Bloody bloody blah. Yeah, no water requirements for farming. Fountain well not enabled. Food poisoning is disabled. And short cook times and no food damage. Yeah. So let's circle the island to see if there are any crates, which I should have done before. But I didn't. What can you do? Hey. Yeah, and um, beating these turtles, or turtles, don't know what the difference is, but beating them to death basically will give you quite a, a bulk of resources which you can use. See these, um, I think, that, yeah, the level you can use to make um, water skins. I think you just click on it and then you just do the no a uh, little bit taken from another yeah, I think we need a knife to make this into a water skin but you can't make it into a water skin which you can carry um water which is obviously useful as you've just witnessed how quickly you can get thirsty um, I'm trying to keep towards the 
the shore, but also at the same time I'm trying to see if there's any uh, water springs um, on the island. There doesn't seem to be any. Actually, if I what, what did I just do? Oh, okay, I just turned it into a water spring. Right. And if you um, hit this type of um, surface for long enough, it would make like a dish where rainwater can be stored. So I'm just going to do that. La 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 la. La 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 la. Yes. No space. I just want to make this into a dish. I don't really care about carrying this right now. So let's just try to. Um, as you can see, I'm making a shitload of mess. Oh my god. Hurry up. Can't be bothered with that. I'm just gonna go look for a natural water spring. Oh, well, it's already. Um, and uh, severe body threats. Just gonna. There we go. Did I have a med kit before? Um, it's just. Go just open up the med kit which contains um, charcoal, gold herb, good against dizziness, um, and yeah, some bandages for external bleeding, I think. Yeah, in um, in a, in a lot of games, um, I'm just I was just thinking to myself there, um, but I was just thinking about um, the fact that um, games use like bandages to recover health, even though you're not bleeding. Um, oh yes, we found a not a natural water spring, but a water bank or water resource, whatever. I'm gonna call it. Um, yeah, um, games use bandages to recover health when you don't even bleed, and I think that's pretty stupid. Well, hey, that's just me. Let's just use a green face. Just green it just for extra level. Boost. Booyah. Let's see if we can um, stop drinking it, man. Store the damn thing. Deflect. Oh, there we go, okay, so it's just pressing E. Now, I haven't played this in a while, so... I am a bit rusty. I don't know how big this island is, but it seems pretty damn big. And I think we should stop building... I mean, like a simple hut, or whatever. So we can actually sleep for the night. So we don't get raped by bears. Or by tigers, lions, whatever. Just get the um uh, well, there's also character statistics which I'm basically like mining um, survival and all the other there'll be more added there'll be more added on like as you do the skills and obviously at the bottom here you've got the uh, day to one and time 17 don't know if that's 17 minutes or not but I am quite tired so we're just gonna have to sleep a bit and we are getting killed by our hunger so we will just eat these. What is that? Oh, a beautiful loaf of saviour bread. And then we'll have some nice orange juice for our lovely breakfast. Do we have a hammer? Mm, we can make one. Yeah, we'll just do that. There we go. 
on a, on a lovely little hammer. And what you do with the hammer is you basically wield it by pressing the number key, and you can, it's like a hotkey. And after you do that, you can uh, right click, and you've got your buildings, tent, shoulder bamboo hook. When you basically make each like one of the, um, the amount of stuff you can build, sort of um, add so you can build more stuff as you build, basically. So we're going to build a shelter here. And all you got to do is just go to one of these four pegs and just keep right clicking. I don't remember why I stopped playing this game. My hands became sore after building like a um, it was I think it was a um, it was a it was a log house or something. And boy that was a serious amount of resources you had to collect for that thing. And my hands started aching and I just said to myself, I can't be us. So I just stopped playing. But um I felt the urge to play this game again and I thought I'd show it to you guys if you if you haven't already seen it. It can be a fab game, but it's just these little tedious little clicking moments where you have to bear with if you want to um, witness the greats of this game. Because this game is it is a great game. Um, the graphics may um, put you off but graphics in the game never actually um, seem to be a downside for any game. For me, I don't really give a crap about graphics. And uh, one off. Dear Lord. And voila. There we go. Made a little at all basically um see now we've got more stuff we can build so like tents shelter bamboo hut tree house tree house tree house so these are just different types of tree houses i think um production campfire we need one of them so we just put one here and we'll add the resources to the pit Hey, where the stone at? Where art thou? I think this will work, I'm not quite sure. So we go, I think we just need one here. Let's go back to uh, HQ. Money hot. Oh, I wasn't watching my um, statistics or. Whatever the uh, top one I think it's called, I don't really, I don't really want to call it just body statistics, I think body state is. Uh, let's just feed ourselves while we're here. Um, okay, there we go. Now we need some uh, branches. Uh, got some vines. I like to make this. Uh, circular motion, wink wink, and um, when taking down the tree, um, it just it feels more satisfying when I'm um, basically trying trying to gather the resources, it just feels like it comes to you faster, I don't know, it just, it, it's just like a psychological feeling, but yeah, if you do play, like, if you do play the game, try doing it, it helps a lot, so Female. And when I say it helps a lot, I mean it helps a lot with bearing with them, um, basically how long you have to wait. And voila, we have a campfire. So now we can make wooden gold forge and distill it. But, um, if you guys want to see um, a let's play of this game, I am more than happy to make make a series for it and um, just leave a comment in the comment section below saying if you want to see me playing 
and let's play this game and I, s I will see what I can do but I can't make any promises but if you guys want to see it then by all means I am willing to make some more videos for when I'm stranded um, got to leave it here guys but thanks for tuning in it's been my pleasure having you here um, I think that's all I have to say bye